Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. As usually, I'm gonna show you the Forzaton and also the cars I've been using for the championships. As you can see, we are at spring and at 50% we have a McLaren F1 and at 80% the Alpine A110 of 2017. Now let's have a look at the Forzaton. Well, let's go to this one. Basically, you just need to sit in an off-road car and make a picture. Then the Forzaton shop. There's a very nice Triomont SL Coupe. Um, it's not one of the best cars to do a race with, but well, since we have a thousand spots in our garage, you should have it in your garage because it is a pretty cool car. It's like a really cool car. Uh, the Maserati, also a good car, but not an OP car. And then we have some clothes. So let's have a look what we need to do. We need to own and drive the Volvo 850R. We need to win four road circuits events. We need to drive 12 miles or 19 kilometers and we need to do five ultimate drift or e-drift skills. Now let's go to the road circuits. So what do we need to do? Let's go to my blueprint. Um, it's here, as you can see, at Mudkickers. I'm already there. Now what you have to do, because it's in the championship, press uh, switch to normal event first. Then we go to solo, custom events, and then here you have the circuit one. I'll show you the code. There you go. You can just put it in and then you will get to the circuits. Now, if you do that, you can always put the Dravatars on new racer and there is no problem with it. Then the next one, we just need to drive. Um, just do the highway three times and you will be okay. And then we need to do the drift skills. Well, basically the easiest way to not get uh, hit by traffic cars or gravitars or whatever. You just come here. And you just have fun with your drifting. The car is set up that you actually can drive the 19 kilometers with it. But also that you can drive... So just do that, press your handbrake or don't press your handbrake, uh, you can easily do it and you will get it while you're doing this. There you go. Now let's have a look at the festival playlist. Here at the trial, I'm actually gonna go there. I'm gonna do it a little bit different today. So what do we need to do? We have a B700 from 1960. So let's sort it out on uh, the year. Then let's take D, C, B, and then we go to the 60s. There you go. So there's a lot of choice that you can actually have in this. Um, my one favorite car is the Lancia. I took it and I won, although I got disconnected from the trial i have no idea why i was in the second race and i just got disconnected so this is the car that i prefer it's also a very cheap car um what else do we have the daytona is also a very good car and the alpha gilia tz2 now there's also the mustang that you can take but i don't know if i have it in my garage and tunes no i don't think so well, basically, I recommend you to take this car because it is one of the cheapest and it's very fast and very good. Um, the other cars are 2.5 million and 10 million. You do not want to waste your money on that. Now, what can you win from that? We win the Volkswagen GR. Then let's go to this here, Playgrounds, A800 Extreme Off-Road. Well, that's basically what you prefer um, so let's have a look I'll have a look what I have extreme off-road there you go the bowler that's a car that I've been using for so so long trail cut very fast car um, you can also use that maybe use that one I think it's a little bit faster than the bowler um, this one is pretty okay you have the tractor um, 
Honda Trophy, I would not really recommend it. The Bowler and the Trail Cut, they have the most grip on that, so I would take one of those. Now, what can we win from that? We win the Ford F150 number 11. Then, let's go to the next one. Here, that was a funny one. Um, I'll actually go to there. There's only a certain of cars that you can use. Um, but there are a few options. There you go. So, what can you do? This car is stable. Not a problem to to win it. Uh, you can win it very easy. The tune is very good. Um, you have no problems with it. This one is a little bit more tricky to control. Um, the peel. I was um, sweating to actually because I have everything off in simulation, not a good idea on the peel. You need to um, put everything on and you will be way better. But actually the peel, you can even use it in stock D hundreds. Um, if you can handle that car, it's really fun to do that. Uh, I also tried this one. That was pretty funny. Now the, it has three wheels. I put five wheels on it. You really need five wheels um, because otherwise you will flip because it's circuit races. So, very easy handling car easy to drive a little bit more tricky um a sweaty car and a fun car so i would recommend this one if you don't want to have too much hassle in steering and everything and just want to have an easy win now what can we win from that we win the ferrari 166 mm then let's go to the next one here we have an S1 900 Country Italy. So let's have a look. So let's go to S1. And then go to Country. And then we go to Italy. Now we have a lot of choices actually here. Um, while I stick to my choice, this one, the Hurricane, is a very good car. I had no problems uh, winning it. Now, if you don't have the car, you can always take the Zonda, for example. Also, a very good car. The F40 is is also a good car, but I wouldn't. Yeah, you can take it, but I wouldn't take it. Um, what else do we have that I would recommend? You can always have the Lamborghini, the 2012. And since it's a road, you can't use this one, or you can't use it. If you have this car, definitely use it or use the Pagani. I also tried this one. This one you had to try very fast um, to actually win it. But this is the car I definitely used and recommend. Now, what can we win from that? We win the Maserati A6 GCS. Then the last one, while well, we need a Volvo C600 cross country. Now, what can we take? I took this one. You can't use this one. So I took this one. It's actually, it's tuned. It has the highest suspension. It's soft. It's very good in handling. I actually had no problems winning the championship with this little turbo. So that's the car I use for that. Now, what can we win from that? The Nissan Pulsar. Okay, so let's have a look at the stunts. I'll put it on. There you go. So the first one was... Um, where was that jump? Here is a jump. So we're gonna... Travel to here. And I will take my muzzler. Now you can also take the the Hoonigan or the Ferrari, but I just take my muzzler if I can find it. I always have problems finding it. There it is. There you go. So I just put the car in third gear. I line up. You don't need to go extremely fast and with the active arrow you can actually let the car move and land on the hood that you even go further 
Now, the next one here. Oh, my game is extremely laggy again. For some reason, it was okay for like 10 minutes when I started the game. Now, there you have two options. You can come from one side or this side. Now, I'll show you, for example, this option. If you go here. You can do this with the Hoonigan or the Ferrari or any other car. Yeah, you can see how laggy my game suddenly became. To just be careful here in the corner. Oh, I have... I don't know if you see it on the video, but... The leg spikes are very hard. There you go. You can also come from the other side. You just need to brake soon enough uh, and hard enough on that little corner because it's downhill. But since the muzzle is pretty fast. As you can see, my speed is 10 kilometers faster going downhill. So you can basically do both sides. Then this one, a speed trap, that's very easy. You can just start from here. Not sure what's going on, but lately the game is extremely laggy. There you go. That's actually a very easy speed trap. There you go. That's everything uh, from the championships and also here, well, you know the deal with um, the monthly rivals and online adventure. Just qualify 10 times and then you only have to do it once. There are new cars. No new cars this week. So it's nothing really interesting at the moment. Now, I will do the trial and playgrounds uh, tonight on my Twitch stream. I do that every Thursday at 9.30 CST, 9.30 PM, of course. Uh, I hope everybody's gonna come. We gonna, I always help the people out with my club members. Uh, it's always fun, so definitely come by, uh, even if you wanna chat or whatever you wanna do. Just have fun and come say hi. Well, that's it. I hope my car choices help you get the cars that you wanted and that you had fun. Okay, bye-bye.